Welcome everybody to Full Hands, Full Heart. I'm Kelly and we are a foster to adopt family hoping to bring awareness, inspire someone else to consider fostering or adoption. Um, it's changed our lives so hopefully we can uh, shed a little light on what it's like to be a foster family. So today we have a special adventure for you guys. We want you to come along with us. We have just left North Carolina. I believe we're in South Carolina right now. And we are headed south to Orlando, Florida. We're taking the babies to Disney World. So we're super excited about that. I have two sleepy boys with me. I have Sawyer over here. And I have Tucker in the back snoozing and Kristen, Lila and the babies are in the van behind me so we you know you got a big family when you got to take two cars to go somewhere so we got we had to up we had to up into two cars so I'm driving Tucker's car now now what's going to be fun about today is we are going to surprise our nieces and nephews they don't know they're going to Disney World with us, and we're gonna surprise them. So at the next stop, we'll show you that. We're gonna show you the, them being surprised. Okay, we've made it to Beaufort, South Carolina, and this is the place where we are going to meet our nephews and my niece. And look, guys, we are all set and ready for the surprise. Kristen did an awesome job making these signs. Disney or bus, let's go to Disney World. Josephine with a little Minnie Mouse. Hayden Ross with a Mickey Mouse. And Fulton with a Mickey Mouse. So the plan is to stand over here and they're going to pull up and see it. These kids have, um, they've really wanted to go to Disney World really bad for a long time, especially since the Star Wars land. And they're going to be so pumped to see this, so this is going to be fun. Alright, so the plan is, they're going to come down this road right here, drive up, and they're going to see this. <laughs> Does that look good? I think it looks awesome. I think it's going to be a hit. Here we go. They are like two minutes away. Okay guys, here they come. They're in the Volvo, pulling up right now. Here they come. They're coming. <laughs> and here's the group right here waving at them. Here we go. Hey! <laughs> you got a car beside you. <laughs> What? No! Bring this side, Hayden Ross! <laughs> Hayden Ross, what? What does it say? What does it say? Yay! You guys want to go to Disney World with us? You do? I don't care. Are y'all going to go? They don't know what to think. <laughs> they don't know what to think. Are you excited? Let's get out of the car. Come on. Get out of the car. Okay. Come here. She's like, I'm coming All right, look. Out. So this guy is, this is a guy from Disney World. He's already there. And he's at the Tree of Life in Animal Kingdom. Okay? Mm -hmm. Let's see what he says. He sent you guys a message. <laughs> hey, hey, Ross, Fulton, and Josephine. Guess what? You're going to Disney World. Have a great time. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Are you excited about Disney World? All right, do your dance then. Oh. <laughs> Are you excited? Yeah. Nine hours later. All right, it wasn't nine since last time we talked, but it's nine total. We are here at our little place we're renting. Looks nice so far. Let's go in and check it out. The kids are already here and got some unpacking done and I think they went straight for the pool. Wow. Yeah. 
Yes, Papa. Big old kitchen. Lots of white furniture. Might not be good with our crew. Bedroom. I'm not going to do a full tour. I'll show you guys around just a little bit. Let's go upstairs. And there's Tucker. He's found the wreck area. He's doing his dance. He's got a cool wreck area up here. Alright guys, I think this place is going to work. As far as rooms and all go, very nice. Happy, we usually stay on property. We're off property this time. We got a little more room. Let's go check out the pool. And here's the pool area. All right, Lila, I got the camera. We're ready for a flip. I don't know what's going on in there. Got Sawyer here, the little ones. Cammy up on the bank. All right, Lila's been working on her flip. Here she goes. Oh, very good. Ta da! Hey, do you like it here? Do you like it here? You gonna go swimming? All right, so that's gonna do it for the house tour. I wanna show you around a little bit. Next up, our plan, hopefully it goes well tonight, is we're gonna get an Uber to the Grand Floridian and try to go to the gingerbread house and get some hot chocolate and try to do a monorail loop. That's the goal on our first night at Disney. Hope it goes well. See you there. Slap. We've got a full on photo shoot here. Alright guys, we have made it to the Grand Floridian at Christmas time. We're here, we're taking pictures, we're doing all that fun stuff. We thought there was a gingerbread house here like there was last year, but we're not seeing, we're not it. seeing it. Unless they moved it, I don't know. But we're cool with the tree, because it's beautiful in here. We're in Disney, we're not mad. Not gingerbread house. <laughs> This is it, the world famous ginger. Just kidding, just kidding. Yeah, no, we don't know where it is. What's that? Who? Mickey, is he got on his Christmas? Yes, he does. Happy birthday. That's Happy a Christmas birthday. present. Happy birthday. You want to see what? So many elite characters: Mickey Mouse, Minnie, Donald, um, Pluto, and then the pig from Mo from Moana. Kind of a weird choice, if you ask me. But okay, Disney, you do what you want. It's been about. It's been about two straight years now of this being by far my favorite hat in Disney. I really, really like it and I still have not bought it. This might be the year, but that 35 bucks, rather quite expensive. So there is one thing that I forgot about Disney and that's the prices. I was looking at this necklace to get my girlfriend, and I may focus, and I really thought it was a pretty necklace to get my girlfriend, and then I saw that $39.95 and remembered that I'm broke. Uh, so yeah, maybe next year. Alright, so I just found a pretty cool section, and that is their 40th anniversary with Make-A-Wish Foundation and so this merch line for the Make-A-Wish Foundation is in all blue and it's shiny and I really like it. It's like the Orlando Magic colors 
and I really like it. This, this one I really like. And also this retro one is really cool. And if I was a girl, I would kill these. And actually, the hat's pretty fly too. They have a really good merch line over here. Oh, it has been a long time since I have ridden on the monorail. And here we go onto the green monorail for the first time in forever. Oh boy. Oh, that's nice.